Today, we're looking at how you balance. Zan, what are you doing? Don't distract me, Chris. I'm about to break the world record for standing on one leg. What? What's the record? 76 hours, 48 minutes. Wow! And how long have you been going for? About 18 seconds. Whoa! Right. Well, it's great that you're giving it a go, Zand. But since the average time that most people can stand on one leg is 30 seconds, I think you're going to need a bit more practice. You're really going to have to work on your sense mm -hmm. of proprioception. It's your body's ability to sense where your muscles and limbs are. Let's demonstrate. Now, when he stands on one leg, Zahn's body becomes unbalanced and he starts to fall to one side. Now, to counter this, his brain activates the muscles on the opposite side of his body and moving his body back to an upright, balanced position. Right, now keep standing on one leg, but this time, close your eyes. <laughs> Balancing with your eyes closed is extremely difficult. It's because your eyes give your brain visual clues about your body's position. But, as well as your eyes and your sense of proprioception, your brain uses one other thing to keep you balanced, your vestibular system. It's part of your inner ear, and it sends constant information about the position of your head to your brain. And it just so happens I have one to show you. This is a pig's vestibular system, which is pretty much the same size as a human one. Now, it's hard to see the vestibular system because it's buried deep in the hard bones just inside your ear. But how does your vestibular system work? Well, the problem is that it's basically too small and too complicated to explain, so I think we should just probably leave it there. What? Don't be such a Johnny Nosplainer! I have a brilliant plan to explain the entire vestibular system. Chris, to the cupboard of everything! Whoa! Have you turned me into a cartoon, Zand? Yep. I had no idea the cupboard of everything could do that. The cupboard of everything can do everything, Chris! Now let's put your vestibular system to the test. Inside your vestibular system, there are three semicircular canals. They're in charge of three different movements of your head. Tilting forwards or backwards, tilting side to side, and turning left or right. As you move, liquid inside the canal stimulates the tiny hairs inside. These send messages to your brain telling it to adapt and not fall over. Wow! So that's why you can do these awesome dance moves and still keep your balance. Yes! And it helps that I'm a cartoon, too. Now, I want to prove that your vestibular system really does keep you balanced by switching it off. Let's get back to the lab. Chris is wearing a special headband, which I'm going to control with this device. I call it Dr Zahn's brilliant big brain blocker box. OK, it's a galvanic vestibular stimulator. Now, this device is going to interrupt the signals sent by Chris's mm. vestibular system to his brain, and it should mess up his balance. Mm. I can only do this because I'm a doctor. Now, first of all, Chris, I want you to stand up straight with your eyes closed. No peeking. Simple, right? But now, let's see what happens when I turn off Chris's vestibular system. <laughs> there you go. There you go. OK, well, look, I can basically stay balanced. I mean, I didn't fall over. But you struggled. So, what I want you to do is jump up and land in the same spot with your eyes shut. With his vestibular system switched back on, Chris has no problem jumping and landing. Simple. OK, now let's see how you do with your vestibular system off. Go! <laughs> OK, Chris, are you ready for the final challenge? Uh, yes. Good. You're going to need this. Wait a minute. Is this my ice cream? How dare you! This is a science experiment. With his vestibular system on, Chris has no problem walking forwards. There we go. Easy. Let's see how he gets on when the signal is interrupted. Go! Chris! Chris! Your ice cream! I mean... My ice cream! So we've shown you that your body stays balanced thanks to your vestibular system. It's constantly sending essential messages about the position of your head to your brain, helping it to do the simplest things like standing upright and walking. Well, it just goes to show that you can't serve the mid-afternoon snack without some help from your trusty vestibular system. 
You've got a little something on your face. Where? Here? Yeah, you, yeah I think you got Can it. I get it? Yeah, you mainly got it. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty good.